Okay, calculus buffs, let's take it to the limit a few more times. I think you all know that the limit as x approaches 0 of sine x over x is equal to 1. That's right, because as x gets small, the sine of x is approximately x, so the x's cancel. Or you can look at the function on a graphing calculator and see that the graph approaches 1 from either side as x approaches 0. But of course, it's undefined when x equals 0. But what about this one? The limit as n approaches 0 of sine x over n. What's that? Well, of course, that's just 6. All you got to do is cancel the n's. <laughs> gotcha. OK, try this one. The limit as x approaches 0 of LXVE. Not as easy as it looks. What do you think that is? Love? Well, OK, but I, want, I don't want the gushy answer. I want the mathematical answer. That would be, believe it or not, less than 3. Or heart. Gotcha. Talking about love, what's the limit as x approaches H of hugs and kisses? Ho, ho, ho? No. Ho cubed? Well, that's better. But, of course, that would just be Santa. Come on, you guys. you got to be creative. Okay, what about this one? The limit as x approaches 8, let's say, of 8 over x minus 8. Yeah, you know that. Plus or minus infinity, because as x approaches 8, the denominator approaches 0, and the limit does not exist. But just to make sure you understand that, what if I change it so that it's the limit as x approaches, okay, let's say 5 over 5 over x minus 5. Same thing? No. Be careful. That would be plus or minus. Gotcha. <laughs> and finally, what's the limit? As x approaches infinity, strange things happen when we go to infinity of, let's say, 3x squared minus 4x plus 7 over, I don't know, 2x squared plus 5x. You may know the answer, but let's calculate it. By plugging in infinity, we get 3 infinity squared minus 4 times infinity plus 7 over 2 times infinity squared plus 5 times infinity. Well, of course, infinity squared is much bigger than infinity, so that's 3 times a really big infinity, minus 4 times infinity plus 7 over 2 times that really big infinity plus 5 times infinity. Well, these terms are small in comparison to that infinity squared, so they disappear. These infinities then cancel, so as expected, 3 over 2. Have you ever calculated it that way before? You can plug in infinity.